You have come at the right moment, father of competence. I hate to tell you this, but my own guards have robbed me. Those dogs! May they never find a drop of water again! You let your own guards steal from you? If you want to do me a favor, hunt down those guys. I already told Bandero, the bounty hunter, about this. But that was the last time I ever heard from him. You're selling water? That can be a profitable business, master of a thousand adventures. A traveler who's dying of thirst would give anything for a cool drink from my well. You can have a cool drink too, if you like. What did the guards steal from you? There were at least 700 gold coins. I want them back. I will bring back your gold. That would be extremely kind of you, master of generosity. I will take care of your guards. I hope they have already withered under Inos's unrelenting sun. May their bodies shrivel. Yeah, yeah, I get the picture. You must hunt them down. Do you hear me? Show me your goods. Show me your goods. Show me your goods. How can Hamid be of service to you, son of distant travels? A man like you must be interested in a good bargain, no? What's that deal you want to offer me? For many years now, I have been looking for a particular artifact. The Amulet of Sorcery. Where is it? Somewhere among the ruins? Not anymore. The busy hands of slaves dug it up from the sand. It is now in the hands of Ilya, the artifact dealer. I will get you the amulet from Ilya. Here, take this gold. It should be enough if you use it wisely. Why don't you go and simply buy the amulet? That's not so easy, son of Frank Speech. If Ilya learns it is for me, he will inflate the price. Who are you? I am Orknarok. That's a strange name. Actually... My name is Oli. Yeah, that's my fighting name. It comes from my time as a gladiator. Why don't you fight in the arena? I did. At least until Angar took me apart. And then no one wanted to see me fight anymore. Philippe sold me to Masil for a song. Greetings, stranger from the north. How's business? Hmm, sometimes good, sometimes bad. I'm working on a big score with Gonzales. But before that, I have to settle a couple of other matters. And I could use your help doing that, warrior. Work for me for a while, and I will make you a rich man. What do you want me to do for you? I have to get this slave off my hands. 
take Orknorak to the Temple of the Ancient Ones. Talk to Fasim there. Let them deal with him. What's the problem? It's the sun. It makes him crazy. Last night, he stood before me in my tent with this penetrating gaze. Just get him out of here, or I'm going to lose my mind. Do you see men from the north here very often? Occasionally. The last one I met said that he was a fire mage. Well, as run down and starved as he looked, it was difficult to imagine that he was once one of those powerful mages. Tell me more about the fire mage. There isn't much to tell. He croaked in the desert. The only thing he had with him was this chalice. He guarded it jealously to the very end. Apparently, the chalice was worth more to him than his life. The fool. Where is the fire mage's chalice now? Ha <laughs> ha! You seem to be very interested in it, stranger. Ha! <laughs> and I thought the thing was worthless. The chalice is in my possession. Work for me, and I will give you the fire mage's chalice. I see. Broken. What are you doing hanging around here? What sort of building is this? I ought to have you flogged for such a stupid question. You're standing in front of the residence of one of the most powerful merchants in Varant. Denzelis has great influence here in the desert, and you will honor his name, or die. What else can you tell me about Gonzales? He is the most skilled merchant in the desert, and Zubin's most important man when it comes to business. So be careful not to arouse the wrath of Gonzales, or things will go badly for you. Yeah, yeah, I get it. How can I do Gonzales a favor? Everyone knows that Gonzales only receives people who impress him and bring him gifts. I see. About the gifts for Gonzales. Speak. What do you have to offer? What would Gonzales especially like? Well. What could possibly please a man of the world? A special hard-won weapon? Beautiful woman? Maybe even if long overdue debts were finally paid. You think of something. Morasul is large. You're sure to find some suitable gifts here. Hmm. I'll take a look around. I bring gold for Gonzales. Ah, oh, yeah. Gonzales will be pleased by this gift. Gold is always good, but gold isn't everything. About speak. Is Gonzales also interested in swamp weed? I have a whole package here. You are a man of taste. Yes, that will please Gonzales. Here, the stuff comes from Lago. Gonzales will be very pleased with this. Call me Ismail. I'm the blacksmith here. The only blacksmith around. I see. You're very busy then? You can say that. Almost everybody here is carrying one of my weapons. Where can I find the merchants? Have you already fought in the arena? Felipe managed to get hold of something special. The next champion will win the Moonblade. Is that not right up your alley? 
Uh, if I were ten years younger, I wouldn't miss the opportunity. If you need another weapon, I can sell you one. And if you want to know how to forge a blade, I can show you. Tell me more about the Moonblade. It is a valuable ancient weapon. It was forged in Bisala. What I wouldn't give for it. Really? Why is that? I want to examine it. Perhaps I can learn from this blade. And how much is the blade worth to you? Hmm, let's say 600 gold coins. Let me take a look at your goods. Hey, you. Are you looking for the temple keys, too? Excuse me? There's only one topic in this wretched town. The artifact keys to the temple of Morasul. Really? The fellow in my pub asks a lot of questions about the temple. I think he knows something. Maybe you should talk to him. What are you buying? Or are you broke already? What do you mean? Nothing's cheap at Morasul. If you have no gold, you're soon down on your luck here. How can I make some gold here? You could try to make some bargains with the merchants. But I think you'd be better off in the arena. Hey, maybe I should bet on you. Let's see, I think I could risk a few coins. Anything else? Well, if you need some gold really badly, I could lend you some. Could you? How much? Let's say 1,000 for you, but then I want 400 extra back. I would like to borrow your gold. Hmm. All right. I think I can trust you with my gold. You've got five days. Then I want my dough back, plus the 400. Here's your gold back. You didn't disappoint me. That was a good investment. You don't look like a Shishin. That's probably because I come from Mertana. Greetings, Keeper of a Thousand Coins. You appear to be looking for something. Are you a raider of the Lost Temple Keys of Morasul? Or is it a fate other than mere hunger for profit that leads you to our hot country, my pale friend? Tell me about the Temple Keys of Morasul. Oh yes, I don't mind if I do. I happen to have one here in my possession. Perhaps we could make a deal. You're a merchant? Very perceptive of you. I trade in artifacts, like so many people of my kind in this country. Would you perhaps be interested in my goods? What do you want for your temple key? You know, I purchased this for a reason. There's something in the temple that I would like to have. What? An old vase. It is covered with ancient writing. I propose this deal. I give you the key. And you bring me the vase. How about it? I will get the vase from the temple for you. Great. Remember, it is completely covered with writing. And if you don't deliver the vase, a bounty hunter will deliver your head to me. Here's the key. And don't be too long. I am looking for the amulet of sorcery. 
Mm, you have come in vain, then, I'm afraid. I have no such amulet. Really? Why don't you take another look? It is very old. Oh, right. One of the old amulets. Yes, I have that. Tell me, why do you want it? Everyone can use a magic amulet. Of course. So why does it have to be this one? I want to increase my magic abilities. With this amulet, I will gain more mana and can cast improved spells. Oh, uh, fine. I will tell you my price. Show me your goods. I don't know you. Are you from up north? You could say so. Hmm. Seeking to make a profit, too? Sure. What else? What are you doing here? I sell. I buy. What would you like to hear? I'm an artifact trader. And as long as things don't go wrong all the time, I'm pleased enough with my humble existence. Show me your goods. This must never happen again. It will all look different in the morning. What's going wrong for you? The slaves at the temple stole the artifacts from the orcs and sold them here in town. Every single trader here in Morasul made a profit. But ever since they caught Yusuf the slave, business has all but come to an end. No, this must never happen again. Tell me more about that artifact thief, Yusuf. He was the best thief among the slaves. He even stole the keys to the temple of Morasul and sold them in town. Those are the most valuable items that the orcs have dug up out there so far. But they're only keys. That's right. But the orcs want to get inside the temple. That's why they would pay any price to get their hands on those keys. Makes sense. I will help you get your business going once more. I want the slaves to work for me again. Sure. You want them to pilfer artifacts for you. Go to the temple and talk to the fat man. He's supervising the slaves there. Persuade him. I don't care how you do it, as long as business goes on. Everything lies in the hand of Beliar. I've been waiting. Stop! Some valuable things have gone missing here! Do you know anything about that? No. We're watching you. Show me your goods. You haven't been in the city long, have you? Then you should know one thing. Morasul is Gonzales's city. Gonzales takes his cut from every business, every deal, even from the thefts. Have you seen the elite warriors running around here? They are under his command. I see. I can get you a couple of missions to put a bit of gold in your pockets. 
Morosul can be very expensive, especially for travelers. What sort of missions do you have? Bounty hunting. I am looking for a couple of really bad guys and a thief. There is also this missing Hashashin. Who is this thief you're looking for? His name is Yusuf. He stole some artifacts from the excavation. What's so unusual about that? First, he stole the artifacts that can be used to open the temple. And second, he got caught and took off. Gonzalez can't let him get away with that. The orcs are still guests in our country, after all. I see. What about that missing Hashishin? His name is Ramirez. He works for the black mage, Ningal. Tell me more about the bad guys. The guards of Kafu, the water vendor on the east side of town. They ran off with his gold, just like that. Hmm. And? Kafu is high in Gonzalez's favor. Do I have to say more? So, you're a bounty hunter. I used to hunt everything, but Gonzalez offered me a good deal. The job here is a bit quieter, but I've still got what it takes. So, if you want to know something... I will kill Yusuf, the artifact thief. Good, but to do that, you'll have to find him first. Take a look around the excavation. If you're lucky, he's hiding nearby. I'll look into Ramirez. Good. All I know is he was on his way to the Fields of Ruins, and he has been gone a very long time. So find out what's wrong. I will track down Kafu's guards and kill them. I have already sent people north and east, but they haven't found anything. And what does that mean? Somebody bold enough to tangle with Gonzalez is also bold enough to stay in the area. I'll find them. What's wrong? Are you lost? Do I look like it? In a way, yes. You're peering into every corner as though you've lost something. Mm. Or you're looking for an opportunity to bag something here in the city, right? As if I don't already have enough problems. And if that were so? Hmm. In that case, I might be able to help you. What's up? Nonsense. I'm looking for work. Yeah, well, watch what you say. I might have something for someone like you. All right. What do you have to offer? The most influential merchants in the entire desert live in this damn city, and their great wealth matches their position. If you help me to lighten their burden somewhat, I could teach you how to really line your pockets again. All right. I'll help you. What exactly am I supposed to steal? A while ago. This quack came to Morasul. <laughs> he told the merchants here stories of a great evil demon. It always comes by night and steals the souls of unbelievers. <laughs> Naturally, there is a remedy. The soul chalice. It would protect its owner from the demon. Five of the merchants here paid a fortune to obtain the soul chalice. Since then, Every one of them has had one standing next to his pillow. Bring me the five soul chalices. The fools will also pay a second time when they noticed that the things are gone. Who exactly has a soul chalice? Fezul bought one. And Ilya as well. That I know. For the others, hmm, I am not quite so sure. Just take a look beside their beds. And don't get any ideas about selling them the items yourself. That requires a bit more sales talent, if you know what I mean. Yeah, sure. Here are the soul chalices. Ha! You are great. You've got what it takes. Congratulations. Here, I'll give you some gold now. Some time will have to pass before I can show up at the merchants with these things. They need to stew for a while first. Teach me something about thievery. Teach me how to pick difficult pockets. No problem. You have enough talent for that. Basically, you don't have to do anything other than what you've done in your earlier thefts. Distract 
and grab. Look your opponent straight in the eye. Most people find that unpleasant, and it distracts them. Then grab. It's worth it. Interested in a little business? What's a mercenary doing in Morasul? Business? What else? You're here to get on the gravy train too, aren't you? What do you have to offer? <laughs> oh, I see I caught your attention. I can tell you how to get your hands on one of the temple keys of Morasul. And? Well, this will cost you a little. How much? 500 gold coins. Where's the temple key? Have you got the gold? Yes, here. Fine. Now, the temple key is outside of town. Desert raiders got their hands on it. They took it during a raid, and are now looking for a buyer. Do you know where those raiders are? Yes. I can lead you there if you want. Lead me to the desert raiders. I will. Follow me. Right, my friend. Time to say your final prayers. I see. You're a desert raider yourself, huh? You had better give me all the temple keys you found, and quick! What makes you think I've got any? Those stupid things are worth a heap of gold here. I already got my hands on one. And someone like you hasn't come to Mora Soul to sell slaves. I bet you already secured a key or two for yourself. And I'm gonna beat them out of you now. I'll show you! Stop right there. Ow. Ah. 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 First a break. You hit
I've been ordered to kill you. Oh, hell, take it easy, friend. Please don't do that. I'm sure I can be useful to you. What should I do with you now? Just tell the people in Morasul that I got away. Hey, nobody gives a damn about old Yusuf. I'll just disappear like water in the sand. And you'll never hear from me again. Hmm, I'll think about it. Yusuf, the artifact thief, has escaped. Ah! Well, that doesn't say much for you, but I'll make sure it doesn't damage your reputation.
Here's Ilya's amulet. Excellent, son of reliability. And here's your reward. I can offer you another deal, if you are interested. Tell me about your deal. Go to Morat's oasis on my behalf and bring him my greetings. Give him the amulet as a present. A present? He will not accept it without offering you something in return. I see. How much should I accept? You will accept nothing less than the lovely Yasmin. She is the price I desire. Yasmin, nothing else. How much is in it for me? Hmm. I will give you a heap of gold, and I will recommend you to Gonzales. All right, I'm in. Take the amulet, and listen. Do not let him trick you. Where is Murat's oasis? Not far from these walls to the west of the city, son of disorientation. All right. That's just going to cause problems. Ah, a fresh face. I'm Felipe, and I run the arena. I am... Interested in fame, glory, and gold? Then you've come to the right place. What are the rules? You buy a combat partner from me. If you win, you get twice the amount back, and the champion will receive the Moonblade. What exactly is the Moonblade? The great prize for the champion of the arena. I can assure you that this is probably the most coveted weapon in all of Morasul. Even Gonzales, the most powerful man in town, would love to own the Moonblade, I bet. Really? I'm ready. I want to fight. Can't wait to see this. Come to the arena! Featuring now, the challenger, the stranger from up north, versus the well-known, formidable, and much-revered Paladin! So what do I do next? If you're not going to check him out, you must enter the arena. That's where the Paladin awaits you. If you leave the arena before the fight is over, you lose. Understand? Right. Get moving, then. Come here. There's going to be a fight, men. Want his home. Ah! Just don't learn! Uh, uh, Do you really think? Uh, uh, I hate the well, beasts! We have a big problem. Someday this will be over. I don't think I want to hear this. Uh, uh, the beast just won't uh, 
Well done. Miserable creature. Someday this will be over. You have to watch what you say. And it gets worse. Sure, why not? Still, it can't go on like this. Still, I don't like it at all. Forget it. You'll only get that once you've earned it. Oh, quite impressive, really. But I still believe you've just gotten really lucky. Lucky? Well, we both know that the Paladin's heyday is over. You have to beat some stronger opponents if you really want to go far. Anctos is a different story altogether. A hero of the people. Handles a sword quite deftly. Give me a real opponent. You've got courage. I will give you that. Listen up, people! Fighting next! The challenger! The Lone Wanderer of the North versus Anctos the Nomad! He came from the desert to avenge the death of his brothers. Will the challenger be strong enough to hold his own against him? Have you got a hint for me? Yes, watch your neck. And now go. Anctos will be waiting in the arena. Come here! <laughs> B 
people are starting to like you. You can always go with them if you beat up a nomad. But your next opponent is a veritable bear. Big as a wardrobe and strong as an ox. They say he can snap a bear's neck with his bare hands. Whatever kind of animal that may be. I want a really good fighter. <laughs> You've got your work cut out for you. Listen, people. Do not miss out on this spectacle. Now fighting the mysterious stranger versus Olek the Bear. Then show me what you've got. I'm not here to chat. I'm here to fight. Huh. One thing I must admit, you had a good fighting instructor. You dirty thief! It's going to be a fight, man. Uh, uh, uh. Show me your goods. I won't say the word. I could have told you that. Everything lies in the hand of Billy. Well, you certainly know how to fight. Respect. You are one of the nomads. So I am. From Kaor's clan. Someday, my brothers will come and free me. Do you think it is wise to say that aloud? The Hashishin do not believe we can ever make it. And you? I am ready to die for my freedom. That's all that counts for me. Where can I find Kaor? I will tell you, although I do not know your intentions. Therefore, be warned. Do not cross my clan. You would bitterly regret it. Get on with it. My clan's hideout is a cave near the west end of the Fields of Ruins. Everything lies in the hand of Belia. You dirty thief! Hey, folks! There's a fight! Well done. No fighting here, got it? Let that be a lesson to you. Bastard doesn't even have any gold on him. <laughs> what a match! What a spectacle! Yeah, yeah, I get the picture. You're ready. Ready for what? The title. Just one more fight, and you'll be the champion of Morasul. Sometimes I feel so tired. Why do they call you a paladin? I was a simple soldier in the king's army, and fought in the war against the orcs. The Hashishin attacked us and dragged me off. Then I had two options, the arena or breaking rocks. An easy choice. Well, and then they gave me this title to attract spectators. It worked. And how was the fight for you? 
Once upon a time, I'd have had two like you for breakfast. And today, I'm sucking sand. Man, I'm getting old. You fought well. This must never happen again. Curse it! What do you want? What is that? Yeah. What do you want? Finish this now. I know, man. I know. Get out of here, you dirty thief! No good will come of this. No magic tricks here! What was that? Beat it! No magic tricks here. What? Why was I want to challenge the champion. I knew you would not settle for just a piece of the pie. You want it all. <laughs> hmm. Citizens of Morasul, it is with great pleasure I give you the upcoming That's fight. The current undefeated arena champion of Morasul, Anga! Versus the current honorable challenger, The Stranger! Doesn't matter to you. You have to watch what you say. Then show me what you've got. That one hit home. Then show me what you've got.
Then show me what you've got. Ah! Uh, Then show me what you've got. Then show me what you've got.
Then show me what you've got. Then show me what you've got. Then show me what you've got. It's going to be a fight, man. <laughs> 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 <laughs>
Then show me what you've got. It's going to be a fight, man. <laughs> Hey, hey, great fight. You are truly a worthy champion. Now what? You, you have out. beaten the champion. Nobody will challenge you for a while, I'm afraid. But I put my gold on you. You earn me a tidy sum. Where's my prize? Here. This noble blade is now yours. I will bring you the Moonblade. Thank you, son of dependability. Here is the reward I promised you. <laughs> You're coming with me now. I'd like nothing better. I need to do something, anything, before I go nuts here. You gave Masil a pretty nasty scare. Hey, I just couldn't take it from him anymore, understand? The guy has no use for me anyway. I gave him a bit of a scare so he won't want to get rid of me. Well, it worked. Come with me. Let's go!